country doctors are talking about the importance of mental health screenings. They say it's important to take care of your mental health early, especially in the days after the pandemic. News 2's Jordan Sayopa has the story. A new recommendation from the U.S. Preventive Services Task Force is shining a light on the current state of mental health issues here in the U.S. Today I spoke with an expert about what we're seeing in South Carolina. This week, the U.S. Preventive Services Task Force issued draft statements recommending anxiety screening for adults under 65. This is the first time this recommendation was made. A low country expert tells me he's surprised it took this long. My reaction is it should have been done decades ago. Uh, depression, anxiety, and stress is ever-present, and it's even more so in the past two and a half years. According to Mark Hood at Trident Medical Center, pandemic-caused factors like financial issues and social isolation have led to this increase in mental health issues. When it comes to screening for anxiety, he says there are a few different options. The most noted one is the Beck's depression, Beck's anxiety scale, and it asks basically um, your um, daily living skills, and how is it sleep, appetite, socialization? Um, do you tend to be more pessimistic uh, than optimistic now? Hood says South Carolina is following the national trend and seeing more depression, anxiety, and stress. He says part of the problem is the stigma surrounding mental health. Another problem, refusal to seek help. And instead they wait until the very end and seek out help when everything has crumbled down. The best approach is to hit it right in the beginning. On a positive note, Hood says South Carolina is rich in resources and even more are coming. Trident is set to open a brand new 60 bed behavioral health hospital in the spring of 2023. And we'll have resources linked on our website, countonto.com. Reporting in North Charleston, Jordan Siopa, Count on Two.